Hey guys, so I'm going to be walking you through what your assignment is today. Remember, we don't have live class, it's just this video. Um, teachers are busy getting ready for the people who are coming back in person starting Monday. So, um, I'm going to show you through six periods class. If you go to your classwork, we did step one together, okay, which was the annotation practice with Ava Umoff. Step two, if you open it up, it should look like this. So we talked about Ava Umloff's story, and Ava Umloff described a time when she overcame a lot of challenges in her life. The biggest challenge being the Holocaust. She was two years old when she was finally saved from the Holocaust, and there were a lot of things that she still had to overcome because of that. Um, she still was kind of like sick sometimes. Um, she had some like mouth problems, I think it, it described in the article. She obviously lost a lot of family members, so she had to deal with like kind of being alone. So you guys are going to have an opportunity to start um, explaining to me or describing to me a personal time when you overcame a challenge in your life. Now you're not going to write the whole essay at once. All you're going to do is fill this little brainstorm out and then that's our first step in our writing process. So, the way that we do this, thesis, what is a thesis? A thesis is essentially a one-sentence summary of what your entire essay is going to be about. So the way I, I say it here is summarize in one sentence what your essay will be about. This is the main idea of your essay and could be a standalone answer. So what I mean is, is don't just start typing blah, 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 blah. This is how I feel, blah, 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 and just like start going at it. It needs to just be one sentence that is your main idea of this entire essay you're going to write. So if we're just brainstorming, it doesn't have to be perfect. This is just like your jumping off point. So if I'm going to write my thesis, which is, again, just my one sentence about my main story, and if it were me, I might write about... A time I overcame a challenge in my life is when I was diagnosed with type 1 diabetes at the age of 15. Boom! Okay, my essay is going to be about the time that I overcame, or the time that I was diagnosed with type 1 diabetes at the age of 15. That is a challenge I have experienced in my life, um, and I'm, I'm going to write about that. That's just my thesis. That's one sentence that is telling you what my essay is going to be about. It is that simple, okay? You'll see under here it says detail number one, detail number two, and detail number three. Now I have to brainstorm what are some things about this that I want to talk about that, again, is going to answer this question of when I overcame a challenge in my life. So um, something I remember about being diagnosed with type 1 diabetes. Detail number one, I was sick for three months. No one knew, and I still tried to play sports. So then this whole paragraph, eventually, I'll just talk about that, but this is just one detail. One detail, I was sick for three months, no one knew, and I still tried to play sports. Detail number two, um, let's see. I lost a lot of weight. I felt sick all of the time. Okay, and maybe detail number three was my sister eventually figured it out that I was sick. She was also a type 1 diabetic, so that kind of helped. And then I was taken to the hospital. And that's it. That's all you have to do. You have to give me one sentence that's going to tell me what your entire essay is going to be about. And just give me three details that you remember about this thing, this, this challenge that you experienced. And that's all you turn in. That's it. All right? If you have questions, if you have anything that you need help with, you are still able to text or email or anything like that. I just won't be live that day because, like I said, I'm going to be um, helping clean my classroom and getting things ready for Monday. So, 
I hope that that helps you. I hope you can figure out how to, to, to do this assignment. I know you guys can. I wish you all the best. Um, good luck. And again, let me know if you have questions.